Yo, yo, what's up, YouTube? What's up, everybody? People want to know how to use brute force really well. So, if you have a PS3, find your game save. You drop it in here. See, this is brute force right here. Then you click on this, and you see this right here. You decrypt all. So, once you click on that, it will turn green. So, it's ready to go into Gib Save Editor. So, all you have to do is go open. Find where your USB is at. Click on it. Um, is this my right USB? Oh, there it is. Found it. And then it's put on PS3. Oh. Bing. Oh, you gotta go inside the folder. There you go. Don't make that mistake. And then it'll pop up like this. Then character, see everything's level 80, OP 10. Here, already have all the weapons on here because I already modded this character already. Here's the here's the ammo, all that great stuff. You just co you just copy and paste this, and then you just go on the raw. Then you just find the bake upgrades, and you just copy it in, in there. Then for for the ammo is right here, so you just copy the ammo in here. Pretty much that's it for the steps how to mod Borderlands. Pretty much. And here's all the skill points, so you can mod all the skill tree. That's how you max out the skill tree for your character. And then pretty much that's it. Um, you can name the character ever you want. You can name it modded. I don't know. You can name it whatever you want. Or it could be hot. You can name it like that. Whatever you want to name it. Just go to save. Pretty much. Go back to your USB. You go find the game save that you want. Well, I mean the game save. I mean the same game save from USB. Click yes. And then this is tricky. And then you go back to real force. Then you click on here. And then you click on all. And verify it. And that's it. That's all you have to do for brute force and everything. I need to download the new brute force. If you guys missing that file for brute force. You could go on Google and search for it. So you just go open for file location and the file I think you guys are missing is probably this one right here this one right here all you have to do is put that in there and the brute force will open and pretty much that's the tutorial how to use brute force better and everything a little bit slower pretty much have a nice day nice day everybody